Hello, a very good evening to you. This is the scene here at the Lusail Stadium, just to the north of the Doha City Centre. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And both teams with one game each under their belt already. Let's see how they fare this time around. It's England against the United States. Well, thanks, Derek. This won't be easy, but a win here, and they will be through to the knockout stages. If they perform at their best, I think they will get the three points that they the England need. first 11. Jordan Pickford stands between the posts. Kieran Trippier starts alongside Luke Shaw as fullbacks. Jordan Henderson starts alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the main striker today is Harry Kane. Here's how it looks for the United States. Well, they're also playing in a 4-3-3 formation, but they play it in a slightly different way, particularly in the wide areas, where their fullbacks will get forward and rotate with the wingers at every opportunity. And a decent delivery. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging someone to get on the end of it. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. Foden, on to Henderson, can he get them level? That is a really disappointing effort, goodness me. On that occasion, just didn't make the right sort of contact, should be testing the goalkeeper from that sort of range. Well, the pass not finding its target. Now space for England out wide, and crossing towards the far post. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? Kane. to make sure he got there. Adams. Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, the good value for the lead. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. Passes like that, very much in his repertoire. Oh, in with a chance! Here. 
Well, here it is, 1v1 against the keeper, and the outcome was never really in doubt. He never looked like missing that. Bukayo Saka. Here's Luke Shaw. It's there for him. And a goal! He's put it away. A celebratory moment. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. Attacking possibilities for England. Firing it in. Oh, that's a fine save. We're getting the ball forward. Harry Kane! And doing all he can to grab his second of the game. Well, he's been a real live wire today. A constant threat to this back line. Well, with five minutes remaining and just one goal between them, still the prospect of late excitement in this match. And attempting the through ball. In it goes to increase their advantage. And will that be the goal that ends up securing it for them? And cuts inside. Could be. Well, fantastic reflex action from the goalkeeper. Corner kick played in. And a bit short with the clearance. Well, the keeper committed himself. Not increasing the pressure. Another corner it is. And he's fired over the corner. They've got themselves back into it. A lifeline in this game. And this could be a dramatic finale. Well, here's another look at it. Certainly, delivery into the box couldn't have been any better. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. And there goes the final whistle. We can say it officially now. England have progressed to the knockout stages of the 2022 World Cup. Well, I think we all expected England to go through to the knockout stages. They've done that. They've played well. Now they've got to put their focus into that last 16 game. It should be a good one. And the shining light for his team. No two ways about that. Harry Kane. Well, he scored one and could have had a lot more. But if you keep getting into the right areas, the goals will come. I thought he was very good today.